I think I like um, Tabu Coco Landorus. Nah. Let's do Tapu Koko, Kartana, Marowak, and Finny in the back. That's what I do here. Locking it in. Don't care about any of your opinions. La 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 la. <laughs> I'm so tired. Diet Kunk. Steps on the coffee 20 minutes later. Alright. If he leads off with a Leckie, that'll be annoying. I, I prefer him to set up Trick Room, to be honest. Under screens, it makes it very easy for me to operate. All right, Incineroar Dusclops, it's pretty good. I mean, the Trick Room's going up. I still want to try to get screens up. Go for that Reflect. Get in my Marowak here. I'll just let the Trick Room go up. He's probably going to fake out the Coco. I still have to try to get the, the Reflect up here. And I'll go for a Protect. I drink Diet Conkledor. Yes. See, he gets in his Finny. Alright, I can operate like those. Get off a light screen. I think I'd rather send in the Kartana here. Eh, Tapu Fini's better. There's definitely a Glacier. That's his last Pokemon. He wouldn't go Trick Room without that. just muddy waters. Eat that up. Let's get my light screen. And no accuracy drop, which is great. I'll go ahead and I'll get in the Kartana here. My Finny is at minus one. It's all protect, I think. Get in Cortana. We'll protect here on what's likely a Max Quake. And he's he's burning through his Trick Room pretty quickly, and I think he has to Dynamax here. Yep. He shouldn't be able to one-shot anything on my side of the field. Without like crits and stuff, so feeling pretty good. It's probably just gonna quake. If he knuckles, he's five head. 
Okay. Into Finny? Into Cart, that's fine. Okay, well, mm. I didn't like that. I didn't like that at all. That was big dumb. That is annoying. <laughs> oh, he's life orb. So he's not weakness policy. That's good to know. That is annoying. Get my Marowak here. It looks like Finny's going to have to just go through this whole team. I believe I always live this. Ah, oh, that is so annoying. That's fine. It's gonna be a really close roll. <sighs> Dang it. Are you kidding me? Come on, man. That's so annoying. That is so annoying. That's two crits. Glacier crits twice. Bro. Alright. I mean, I can Dynamax here. I'm still behind screen, so it's not the end of the world. But I have to start targeting down Glacier above all else. And of course, like, Incinera is just going to want to get out of here. Thunderbolt the Glacier for damage. Bro, that's so annoying. I feel like you could tell by how slowly the health was going down that that crit 100% mattered. He should parting shot here pretty much every time. Yeah, I'm just dumb and I forgot to check. <laughs> That's such an annoying way to lose. Because I just don't break through him anymore without critting every single hit. Yeah, I'll just forfeit there. I can't win this. Bro. Alright, let's let's collect ourselves, try again next round. At minus one I'm not KOing anything. Unless I get like as many crits as he did. Alright. Put the same rules. How do I do that but not lose? I could just completely deny him Trick Room. That's another option.
I think I have to lead off Finny here in Marowak. In the back, I still need Coco, I think. Cartana's a must. Yeah, and Coco. Okay. That's Life Orb and Scope Lens together, yeah. The losing Kartana so early was so huge. That was probably going to be my Dynamax target. The only thing that should be ignoring the crits on his side of the field should be that Urshifu. <clears throat> <clears throat> hmm. He should just go with what happened before. If I, den if I deny him Trick Room, I'm in a really good spot. Which I should be a position. I should be in a position to deny him Trick Room. Or maybe I just don't deny him Trick Room. Let's think about this. I could probably one-shot the Incineroar, which is kind of big, if I Dynamax early. Because he's going to fake out. I'll just muddy water and get damage off. I'm not going to Dynamax yet. I can't Dynamax early. This team doesn't function well if you do that. Okay, Dust Cops, go off. Can Parting Shot miss? That'd be phenomenal. That's fine. There's his Tapu Finny. Alright. There's the Trick Room. He has Pain Split, right? Yes, yes he does. So he also has Recovery. Hey, Scene, thanks for the sub, man. Alright. Time to stall at Trick Room. Uh, I think here I should always go into my... I'm going to Moonblast here. And I'm going to go into my Kartana. If I can get a special attack drop, that's pretty good. I'm running some speed investment. The Nightshade. Makes sense. Is he going to Calm Mind? Special attack drop would be great. There's his calm mind. All right. So I would say Incineroar always comes in here. And he can't burn me too. So what I'll actually do is this. I'm going to make the read for the Incineroar to come in. I'm going to Dynamax early, which might be a little scary, but I have to do it. Do I do this? I mean, I have to Muddy Water, of course, right? I 
This could be scary. I'm gonna try it. Bring in the Incineroar. Yes, okay, we got him. This will KO, 100%. Finally, we get something. Are you Figgy? No, he's Citrus. I think this will still do it. Alright, my type of Finny avoids, which is great. Take a chunk there. Oh! Close. Close. I just always muddy water here and I get out my Kartana. How many turns of Trick Room are left? Two turns of Trick Room. I could Dynamax here. Just Max Geyser and Cineroar. Bring in the Coco. Because I can I can win with my Finny at this point. Also, we know that I'm slower than his Finny. If I got that KO there, that would have been huge. Something in here is taking a strong hit. Nothing that really wants to either. The only issue is my Coco is also taking a pretty big hit. Okay, I'd rather be Glacier than anything else, to be honest. That's a two-shot. Hey, Coco, the goat. <laughs> Critical hit. And the special. <laughs> and the uh, the accuracy drop. That's not fun. I want the trick room to end before I can start doing work. I think I just get damage off on the glacier and they might need I might need to let them have the cocoa. Try to get a reflect off. Yeah, because they're going to Dynamax Glacier here. And they're going to Quake. Luckily, that's the last turn of Trick Room. So they're pretty Kartana weak now. Should bring him down to about 30%. Barry. Always send in the Kartana.
And Finny has Protect, which it should go for here, I think. I can KO this Glacier right now. I'm making a read, and it might not work out. Max Geyser the Finny. Smart Strike the Glacier. I think it's within range. Okay, we're good. As long as I can take this Muddy Water, I should be able to win. Yo, Cartana! Goat! Hey, another accuracy drop, though. That's annoying. Get some damage off. I hope the rain runs out. Dusclops does have haze, and I think he should always go for it here. So I'm going to hope that this KOs. I need to not miss. And we miss. Goes to the trick room, that's fine. I should be able to eat a Muddy Water, but not if he goes for, um... I have to switch out, yeah. Who's more important, Marowak? Under Trick Room, Marowak can win, but it's not comfortable. I'm gonna switch out my Finny right now for Marowak. And Leaf Blade the Bear Finny. As they withdraw, that's fine. Because I'm going to get a KO here and just go right back up to neutral. I think they'll haze, which is actually perfectly fine by me. That's fine, we both have garbage HP. And I think I'm actually in a better position to win now. Because that Dusclops has no way of protecting itself. And I can just go for Shadow Bone into it. Also, the rain is gone. Yeah, I think I win this. It's definitely within Shadow Bone range. That was such a terrifying match. Finny would have to crit to KO me. And just to play it safe, I can double into the, the Dusclops. Because it doesn't make a difference. Actually, no, I should always target Finny. Yo, Marowak! <laughs> no accuracy drop? Okay. So I just managed to sneak in game two. I'll actually switch out here, go into Finny. Go for Leaf Blade on the Dust Clops. All 
All right. Game three. <sighs> okay. I need a banger. Coco hasn't really been doing anything. I think I might bring Moltres on the lead just to absolutely deny him his trick room. Make sure it never goes up. Because Moltres Marowak completely deny the trick room lead. Finny Cartana. Locking it in, not thinking about it. If I lose, I lose. If I'm not going to psych myself out. Sometimes you just got to do that. You just got to not psych yourself out. He's going to go with the Trick Room lead. It's been working out well for him. Incineroar Dust Cops, please. That's not what I wanted to see. That's not what I wanted to see. But honestly, it's not terrible. I don't think he goes for Trick Room here. I think he Dynamaxes his Glacier to try to pick up an early KO. I think he switches out and tries to get an early KO. Watch this play. This is a very scary play I'm making. Yep, Incineroar. He's going to give me my weakness policy too. That's what matters here. In the sun, he should always go down. I need him to Dynamax too, though. Hell, if I crit, I'll be happy. How do you feel about Tapu Koko plus a little Marowak core? It isn't really a core. These guys aren't really, like, ones that usually come together. It's mostly Coco Moltres. That's, that's usually what the core is like. However, I do think Marowak Finny is really good. Okay, good. He Dynamaxes. And I think this should always two-shot. If he quakes, I'd be even happier, because then the sun stays up. Yeah, it's going to be close. It's going to be real close. He quaked. Okay, cool. He just crit me again. Bro, I hate it here. <laughs> I think I hate it here, dude. His Incineroar outspeeds me is the issue, so I have to always go for the Air Slash and hope. Bro, I think I hate it here. Um, ooh, my play. Bring in the Kartana. Maybe I just revenge with Kartana. I kind of need Marowak for the endgame, and I also need Tabu Finny. Screw it. I need the luck too. I need the luck. That's how I'm winning. 
Give me the luck. Didn't work. Unfortunate. Another one? Bro. Bro. <laughs> I know it didn't matter, but that was just insult to injury there. That was just absolutely insult to injury. So here's the thing, his Glacier absolutely dies to um, Moonblast plus Smart Strike, so I have to make the read here and go for Muddy Water plus Sacred Sword. And at plus one, I'm really scary to him. Because he does have Protect. He should Protect here. As he does not. Tell me you quaked into the finny. Okay, I'm fine with that one missing. No! <laughs> Why? Why? Uh, well, we're in loser's bracket now. That really sucks. Yeah, that turn one... That turn one max quake crit really, really was bad. I'm just going to spam Muddy Water and hope that it works out. <laughs> just get every single accuracy drop. Oh, he's faster. We're speed tied. Good game. Well, that's annoying. 